seen so weak. Whoops, what happened just now? Apologies, there you go. There you go. All right, so we have a ready from Joel. Torza, if you can give us the ready. Sadly, in a one player view, we don't get to see Torza's head. We get to see someone else in. Oh, we get to see him in the mirror. We see the back <laughs> of his head. The back of his head was a yes. myth. <laughs> All right, so both Enough. players giving us a ready. I'm going to do the countdown. Three, two, one. Tetris. Oh, Mela is not from Indonesia. Sorry about that. I always thought Tor I always thought that was only the front of Torza. I never knew. I always thought there was no back to him, but now we know. <laughs> now we know he has a back. <laughs> All right. So let's see here. All right. Nice clean board by Torza. Epinephrine. A little bit of a a little bit of a dirty board to begin with. Still early days. All the same. All right. So. Joel's probably going for early uh, early two, column two, no, column two? Row two. Row, row two, two, yeah, yes. row two. An early row two Tetris board. Everybody is keeping their fingers crossed that uh, Joel's emulator doesn't misbehave again. Yes, let's it, hope it doesn't. And especially at this point, it's a bit too late to, yes. to just call a restart, if, even if it uh, went crazy. All right, so it seems that we, we, we said the wrong thing earlier. Melon is not from Indonesia. If he can correct us by telling us where he's from, I think that would be uh, very interesting, very useful. Yes, Melon, uh, why don't you tell us yourself? Yes. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, so we, we haven't managed to put uh, the player profiles in the in the display. First time we are doing this here. So oh, he's from the Philippines. Oh, he's from the Philippines. Even yes. better, even better. Now we have even more. Yeah, so we have four countries in the semis. We have Indonesia, Philippines, Singapore, and Thailand. One for one for one spot for a different country. Yes. All right. So far, both players are doing great. Both are clean, but uh, Joel's uh, over three Tetris is behind. His pacing is likewise three pace. He's three Tetris is behind on pace. Yeah. So. So 165k versus 89k. Torsa well ahead. Still early days though, regardless. Yeah. Oh, an interesting miss drop by Torsa. He's also building a, a roof. Yeah, he's going for rainy in Portland. Uh, Boom. Okay, easy. Oh, I, I thought he would have burned this. Okay, perfect. He did it now. So he's towards us playing it safe. Yeah, safety burns. No need to get so aggressive, especially when you have a lead. Even this, especially this early on, dare I say. Yeah. Torza is now Tetris ready. Joel is Tetris ready, takes the Tetris, reduces the lead to 0 0.3 Tetrises. Oh, Torza is a little bit high. He needs a long bar. Oh no, he's gonna hang the L. Not like this. Yes, Joel. And, and Joel takes the game. Joel takes game number one. Joel takes game number one. Joel, you can top out. If yes. you're hearing this, you can top out. We can give Joel his heart right there. Oh, that hang was very unfortunate. I, I don't know if Toza is, is, is having trouble because he's trying to orient his webcam so we can see him. Don't worry about the webcam, Toza. Just make yourself comfortable to do your best possible play. All right. Yeah, don't worry about mm. it. <laughs> or you can do a, or you can pull a Yanni and put a, a mirror in front of, uh, <laughs> put a mirror in front okay. of the camera. He says, "No, I'm fine. Nothing technical about it." Okay, so we had a ready for both players, and I think we can go straight into game two, right? All right, let's do this. Let's do this. All right, wait. We'll just wait for Torza. All right, Torza's yeah, ready. ready. All right, let's go. So three, two, one. Tetris. Tetris. And Still game two is underway. So, ooh, Joel with the pushdown points. And Forza, <laughs> not so much. Joel striving on uh, newfound confidence of being so high in semifinals. This is the this is the furthest. Uh, Actually, has he? I'm not familiar with uh, any of the tournaments he's been in. Then again, I really need to keep up with, uh, with with what's happening around the scene these days. So let's see here. Joel with uh, forty-eight thousand points, two Tetrises to start. Torza not quite Tetris ready. Ooh. He needs to clean this up. Okay, okay. This is a little rough. Is he, for is he gonna try to do a dirty Tetris at this height? Uh, yes, not, he is. He was trying to. Yeah. I think. He, oh, oh no. He has to. He has to abort. Abort. Abort mission at this yes, point. Yes, yes, yes. Burn. Burn it down. Burn it down. Oh god. 
Okay, okay. This okay. is this is this is rough. This is rough. Okay, good pieces. Okay, burning his double down will really really help. All right, he's clean. Oh Ooh. wait, what was that? Torza. Okay, he, he can still get out of this. He can still get out of yeah, this. Yeah, but while he's doing this, uh, uh, Joel, he's building a lead. He's almost four Tetrises ahead. Oh, I'm Torza actually is worried. fighting for survival right now. He's just dumping pieces left and right. Yep. Oh, okay, good. He gets the LPs. All right, he should be he's safe. Still alive, yes. He's he should still be alive. safe at this point. No more miss drop, please. <laughs> All right, okay, perfect, perfect. Okay, it looks okay. like he's going to get out of this. Just fine, just fine. All right, he's good. Uh, I don't know. It's, he still needs goose pieces to get out no, of this. No, yeah, now he needs good pieces. Oh no! Oh no! He can't get any oh, no. right. Just... That's it! It's over! Yes, it's over. <laughs> Alright, so, Joe, you... Joe wins. Wins game number two. Oh my goodness. Wins number two. This is 159k to 48k. A second victory for Joe. 2 0. <sighs> okay, everyone. Everyone, this? take a deep breath, everyone. Come on, don't panic. <laughs> this would be a true, true underdog story if Joel makes it to the final. <laughs> yes, take a deep breath, Torza. It's, it's fine. Sorry. It's fine. All right, all right. You know, take a minute. Take a minute. It's okay. Warm up yes, done. Yes, he yes. All breathe, right. Torza, breathe, Torza, Torza, Torza is telling us he's gonna do a reverse trip, and this plan, this was his plan all along. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> I like to see that happen. Yes. All right, Joel. If you can give us a ready, we can be ready for game number three. And this is, uh, well, if, if Joel wins, he's off to the finals. Okay, we have ready for both players. Let's go. Three, two, one. Tetris. Tetris. I like towards this plan here. It's like, it's like, it's like what, it's like what Sun Tzu once said. You just need to win twice. You just need to lose twice and then do a reverse sweep, right? <laughs> Sun Tzu said that. I, 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 I think Sun Tzu <laughs> said that. Or was it, uh, was it something else? I can't remember now. Well, anyways, uh, nice clean, uh, nice clean uh, setup by Torza. Boom! Early Tetris for Torza. All right, but Joel is on an early one Tetris lead. Okay, both players are Tetris ready. Joel getting better pieces right now. Nice uh, T-spin. Oh, unfortunate pieces, unfortunately. RNG not so friendly, but that's okay. You're just gonna burn this. Nice easily. pieces there for Torza. Yeah. Torza is clean. Had it's a bit of a messy board. I'm not saying messy, it was jagged, so it could have gone out of hand really yeah. easily if he got the wrong pieces. But you know, he got all the right pieces, so yeah. now he's nice and clean. Yeah. Oh, Ooh, nice spin. Oh, oh, Ooh, what was that, though? Okay, never mind. It was a. Uh, Probably a miscalculation of what would burn there, probably. Yeah, yeah. That's that's my guess as to what happened. Okay, so he needs to burn like a couple of lines to be clean again. Or oh, he's gonna try to go for a dirty Tetris. No, he doesn't. No, no, He no, wants to take it safe. It's, it, it's, 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 it, that's too risky a play at this, at this stage of the game. Yes. I mean, one loss and Torza is out. Torza is out. Torza is on the brink of being yeah. knocked out. Yeah. After a stellar qualifying run actually yep. it, it was genuinely stellar in case anybody doesn't realize doesn't know this um i think this is Torza's best qualifier ever um he got nine hundred thousand uh over average of three so i i think that might have been one of his best runs because he he was like i'm, I'm stopping you know i have 20 minutes left on the clock but i'm stopping this yeah. is this is this is great this is great for me <laughs> uh boom tetris for Torza. Right. Nice, nice tea, uh, nice tea tuck for Torza, and he's Tetris ready, waiting for the line. Beautiful build, uh, but Joel is ahead by half a Tetris right now. Yes, uh, but he is a little bit behind on pace though. Yeah, if we look at their Tetris rate, the Torza has a higher Tetris rate, sixty-one percent versus forty-nine for Joel. So, which means that from a pace lead perspective, uh, Torza is ahead. Actually, he's also ahead in score right now. Yeah, I mean, it's just a little bit. They are neck and neck at uh, one thousand point difference. Very, very neck and neck. So let's see here. Ooh, Torza is in a bit of a mess here. Not he, the he worst. Ne he needs the long bar. He's not. Oh. He. It's not. Oh, ooh. Oh, this is this is risky. Oh no. He needs ooh. good pieces right now. He needs a long bar. Where's the long bar? He's getting drowned. <gasps> Twenty piece drought. Oh no. Long bar's too late. Can he get anything to the left? Can he get anything to the right? Okay, okay, okay. He's. This is not. This nice. Oh, yes. yes, he gets it. <gasps> Beautiful oh, Tetris. He gets out of there. 
Oh, this Torza. Is, this is so stressful. Don't, don't kill us like this. Yes. A triple for Torza. He brings his stack all the way down. He's safe now. He can, he can rebuild and clean up. Think of us if not for yourself. Yes. We can't take this. <laughs> All right, he's not going. All right, for he's the... gonna he's gonna clean up. Yes, I, yes. Yeah, he's not gonna... Oh, maybe he's gonna try a dirty Tetris on row two. Yes, he is. Yes, and then right. column nine. Okay, so actually, with all these shenanigans, he's ahead by one Tetris. Yes, yes, he is. Okay, so he's burning a bit. He's going to go for a center well. Nice center welling. Good long pieces. Ooh, interesting. Dangerous play right there. He's need, yes. He needs this bar. Oh no, oh, the no. bar comes at the wrong time. It's okay. His well is open. Oh, no. oh, he blocks as well. Just, just at the wrong time again, and the well is blocked one more time. He needs a good piece right now. Ugh. Oh, no. oh, okay, this is fine. This is fine. He can still get out of this. He needs all right. He has the right piece of square. It's great for the left side there. Yes, open this is up. Perfect. Boom. And he takes the Tetris. Perfect. So, with that though, Joel managed to take the lead. He's ahead at uh, almost a Tetris, Tetris. Yes. but he's still behind in pace. Torza has a better pace of almost two Tetris lead. Boom, Tetris for Torza. All right, so Torza, Tetris ready again on the center well here. It's maintaining the center well. Yep. I think he's trying to go for it. Oh, he gets a free, he gets a free well transfer there. Nice. Always left the well transfer. Yep. Meanwhile, um, we saw that Joel was transferring his well to the left. Uh, and he's done now. He's Tetris ready, waiting for the long bar. The, the players are neck and neck in score. They're just 2,000 point difference. Uh, Joel takes the lead with back-to-back -back Tetrises. He's now ahead by almost two Tetrises. But he's still behind in pace. In terms of Tetris rate, Torza is at 54% Tetris rate. Joel at 52. Joel Torza, transitions at 457,000 points. That's pretty good. Torza, Torza still have 10 lines to transition. Torza's a little bit ahead of pace going to transition as long as he hits those Tetrises. Nothing too crazy now. Hey now. Joel is waiting for a T spin, but the T wouldn't come, so he just burn it out. Which is fine. Safety first. All right, Tetris ready for Torza. Boom, Tetris for Torza. Torza is just one line away from level 19. He's gonna try and squeeze out just one more Tetris. Oh no, he's not. Pieces won't allow it. Not worth it uh, going for that kind of uh, crazy aggression just before the, the, the going to 19. Ooh, Torza going for the safe burn there. Didn't like the looks of the, the long bar on that, uh, creating a line dependency there. Joel is Tetris ready, takes the Tetris. He burns it down for safety. He could have put that piece on the left, but he I think he was a bit worried. Oof, Torza. Torza is playing a little bit safe here. Just putting a lot of things on the left here. Torza is behind by one Tetris, but he's still ahead on pace. Boom, Tetris for Torza. Yeah. Oh, Joel's a little bit of trouble here. All right, good. He's Two burning pieces. it. He needs a long bar. Boom. Joel takes the Tetris. Joel is still ahead by one Tetris. Uh, both players are still on max out pace, but Joel not by very much anymore. Ooh, Joel. Nice play by Joel. Sorry, my, my cat decided to comment it as well. When she demands to be the center stage, yes, she... Yes, for your enjoyment. <laughs> she will be the center stage. <laughs> Alright, Joel has a beautiful ball right now. Takes back-to-back -back Tetrises, maintain his lead of, oh, Joel. of almost two Tetrises, and another Tetris. Oh, the Tetris are like raining down on Joel's side. Oh, oh, dangerous no. play. Oh, Torza. Torza takes the Tetris, but Torza is in trouble. Torza, oh, oh no, he, can you get anything to the right now? He can get he it. He can, but, but there's only one line burn out of it. Oh no, Torza might be in tr might actually be in trouble here. Yes. Oh, oh no, he can't take the bar across. And this is a sweep 3-0 for Joel. Oh my goodness. Joel is going to complete the underdog story. Wow, okay, Joel, you have won. Let me send him a message. I think Joel is probably the only player in top four who's actually been to the loser's bracket. I think so too, yeah. No, wait, Mel Melanzola was in the loser's bracket. Was Mel also in I think in the lower, lower bracket, I believe, yes. The story still continues for Joel. Yes, it's yes. Amazing. Well, Joel's not gonna get a max out here, but still, he makes it to the finals. Yes, so let's give him his heart. And I think that that game deserves a winner animation. Let's so give let's it to give him. It to hey, look at that! We have webcam even! 
Wow! <laughs> I think Joel can't believe him, can't believe this. I can't believe this. Yeah, so Joel is up to the final. Well done, Tola. This was a great game as well. 720k versus 600k. Beautiful play by both players. This is amazing. Uh, let's get a look at our brackets and move the players. So what happened just now? We do this and we bring Joel right here. I don't know how to do this like that. Yeah, so there you go. We have Joel who takes the first finalist spot. Uh, and we need Dimzi and Melanceda for the second semi. So let's bring Dimzi as player one and Melanceda as player two. Let's see if they are here. Okay, so we have Melanceda's cam. He is connected. I do not see Dimzi's cam. Come on, Cam. Show up. What's going on? Ugh, I hit this Cam thing. This should just work. I made it so that it would just work. Let's clear it the victories. It just works. Yeah. See, I just, come on, I select him and then just work. Show up, Cam. Yes! Yes, perfect. All right, now we can bring him in. We can bring them in. Awesome. Um, Melon, okay, I don't know if it's possible for you. Is it possible at all to for you to bring the webcam slightly up? Because your face is slightly hidden by the runway box. And if we have to choose, we'd rather see your beautiful face than your tights. <laughs> oh, he cannot hear me, of course. Shit, so I should send him a message. Are you ready? I'm able to bring the cam just a bit down. Fortunately for Melon, it's not the sapling on the computer. Unlike most of our, uh, unlike most of the, unlike all the emulator, not all, I guess, most of the emulator players. Anyway, he did it the wrong down. Now we see more of his tie and less of his face. <laughs> <laughs> I guess he mean more like, uh, no, as in, yeah, as in, bring it up. He says, is it okay now? I'm going to say, the other down. <laughs> as, in push your, as in push your screen backwards. Yes. <laughs> Point your camera upwards. Yep. <laughs> ah, yes, right. that looks Perfect. better. That looks better. Okay, See that now. looks better. That looks better, yes. Okay, he's adjusting. Ah, good, we good, can good. see him. Perfect. Perfect. So that's much better. Okay. So let's just give both our players a bit of time to warm up and yep. then uh, we can get some readies in the chat. And, and this is our second semi final. It is 6 10 pm here in Singapore. We've um, been up for five hours. Yep. So, so far, so good. Oof. But yes, what an upset! Yeah, it's been an what an upset! This is there have amazing. Been yeah, there have been a lot of upsets throughout this uh, this entire run, but of course, none nearly as uh, none nearly as insane as uh, Joel's <laughs> Joel's upset run. <laughs> oh, that was a nice All try right. by Dimsy. Do we have a little final with both semi-final participants? I don't know if we have time. It's actually, initially we thought we'd be 1.30 to 6 p.m. And it looks like we'll be up for another 6.30. So probably no little final, I think. Yeah. Are we to the final test engine? Yes, we, we can see how long it takes to get the final done and then see how much time we still have. All right, so Dimzi gives us a ready and Melanzada also gives us a ready. So I think I'm gonna do the countdown. In three, three, two, two one, Tetris. Tetris. What a day it's been, and honestly, yeah. we've been here for. We've been here since uh, since midday, and now it's uh, sun's about to set. Yes, we. I think we couldn't really do this every week, eh? No, <laughs> we can't do this every week. Maybe <laughs> once a year. Yes. Maybe once a year. <laughs> uh, we don't have the stamina. Mm -hmm. I don't have the stamina. I need to get in shape. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Dimsy is playing high. His board is clean, but uh, he's high. So, looks like we have some melon sodas in chat for melon soda. 
Do we have any Dimsy supporters out there in chat? Texas Razor. Hmm. All right, so nice clean boards. Oh, Dimsy has a double line dependency. Okay, he's gonna try to build for dirty Tetris. Oh, uh, he can't. He's gonna getting... burn a triple for safety. Things are getting very, very dicey here for Dimsy. Yeah. Uh, so and that that is allowing Lem Melon to take a big lead right away. He yes. has actually not that big of a lead just yet. But he'll soon have. But he's it. building it. Yeah. Dimsy has holds everywhere. Dimsy is not gonna be in a, any kind of like Tetris ready situation for a long, long time. Even if he does get out of this. Yeah. Okay, he's burning down. He's much safer now. Takes a triple. Oh, nice oh, line spin. Oh, beautiful line spin right nice there. Nice line spin. Okay, and his blunt is, is clean. Would you believe this? It's actually what? clean. Wow. That was fast, actually. That yeah. was really fast, given uh, given how how given how given dirty the, the, the board was a moment ago. Yeah. So, but Melon has really taken this opportunity to take a lead. He's ahead by four, three Tetrises right now. So 71k ahead, the score is 168k for Melon to 97k for Dimsy. Okay, Melon has some interesting tuck to do to clean up. Oh, Dimsy is in a little bit of trouble here. Oh, he's in massive trouble. Long yeah, bar. Oh. He, he needs another long bar. He's not out of it yet. No, uh, he, 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 he's safe-ish. He's safe-ish. He okay. very nearly lost that. If that long bar hadn't come along, he would have been out. Like, yeah. no doubt about that. Oh, he's trying a dirty Tetris on row five, which he gets. Wow. Okay, Melon also got a dirty Tetris on row three. So let's see here. So both players are back to having a clean board. So Melon Soda in the driver's seat right now, nice and clean. Two Tetrises ahead. So 250k for Melon Soda and oh, 172k for Dimsy. Line dependency in the middle here. Both players just breached the 60 line map, so they are halfway through level 18 right now. Oh, Dimsy. Dimsy's board is getting really, really nasty here. Oh, the nice what flat is, burn. Yeah, that what was that? that LP still. She's just trying to do some safety burns, I think. I, I guess. I hope it wasn't a, mis uh, it wasn't a miscalculation of, of place there. Anyways, looks okay. like he's going to get out of this yeah. nice and clean. But that really allowed Melon to again take, uh, expand on the lead. He's now ahead by three and a half Tetrises. And he's Tetris ready, while Dimsy is not. He's waiting on that S piece or Z piece. Long piece is just as good. Okay, Dimsy is going to be Tetris ready. He is Tetris ready now. He has a clean board. Both players have a clean board. Melon takes the first Tetris. He's now six Tetrises ahead. Nice T-spin. Oh, oh, very no. nice adjustment by Melon. Very I thought, nice. I thought it was a misdrop, but <laughs> it was totally deliberate. Very nice spins there by, by Dempsey there. Did a double spin to, to clean up his column nine hole. Yep. So now both players are Tetris ready. They're waiting for the bar. So Melon is ahead by four Tetrises right now. And Dimsy, Dimsy just needs to clean out his board. Now he's tet uh, Tetris ready, but he's uh, line dependent. Fortunately, he gets the line piece. Now Dimsy, Dimsy just needs to clean out his board. He really needs to pick up the pace here. 300,000 points for Dimsy, 429,000 points for Melon Soda. So Melon Soda is like on a tear right now. Yep. Um, Dimsy needs to put needs to put the gas puts the needs to hit on the gas as soon as he hits level nineteen. Yeah. I mean, if we can see, their Tetris rates are both stable, but uh, Melon Soda is keeping a sixty five percent Tetris rate, uh, while while Dimsy is at forty two. So it's gonna be a, oh nice spin by Dimsy. Okay, he made a dangerous delayed burn, but he got exactly the piece that he needed, so that was great. So let's see here. So Melon has reached, so the, the lead has reduced a little bit, but not by much. He's still ahead by four and a half Tetrises. At this, at this rate, it's going to be a hundred. It's, it's going to be about a hundred K difference by the time we get into level 19. Yep. So transition is coming for both player. Like, imminently. Honestly, honestly, at this stage, if Melon Soda just takes a few safe, uh, a few safe Tetrises at this point, it's going to be really, really hard for, for Dimsy to catch up. Yep. So Dimsy has transitioned. Melon has transitioned.
Uh, we are in the four, 550k versus 450k. Ooh. Both players having clean board. Dimsy gets the line. Oh no! Melon Soda might be in trouble. Oh, no, he gets, gets it. the line. Gets it. Perfect. But this is dirty. He needs to clean this up right away. Well, he, he has time. He has okay. more than enough time. Yeah. He has more than enough time. He just needs to slowly burn this down. Uh, his lead is more than enough to, to buy him the time he needs. Look at that. Yeah. He's almost clean already. Clean. Yeah, clean as a whistle. That was beautiful. Now he's even Tetris ready. Boom! Tetris for Melon Soda. Yeah, he's maintaining his lead. 3.6 Tetris is ahead. That build up he had done before transition is really paying off here. Dimsy is still under massive, massive stress here trying to yeah, catch but up. But his on Tetris ready gets the Tetris. He reduces the lead below three Tetrises. 74,000 uh, 74 point, oh, 74, points behind for Dimsy. Ooh, Melon! Oh no, Melon, could, Melon is in absolute trouble oh. here. Can you get the long piece? Yes! Oh. He gets the long piece, but he didn't get the square over! No! And Melon tops out at 645,000. Dimsy is behind by two and a half Tetrises. One and a half Tetrises right now. Dimzy is gonna, well, catch up. You need 43,000 points. Dimzy, you need to reach 645,000. Yes, you need 645,000 points. You're not out of this yet. Yeah. Okay, he's playing for the safety burns. He's going to, he's gonna line this, probably gonna line single, doubles, and triples yeah. on his way out here. I would if I were him. He has more than enough, more than enough runway to, to make it out of there. Okay, he's he's less than a Tetris behind right now. This 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 is Dimsy's to lose at this yeah. point. Looks like we're having a little bit of network issue with the frame, but Dimsy takes the Tetris and takes the game at 655k. <sighs> wow! Well done, Dimsy. The game is yours. Uh, let's give Dimsy the first heart of this semi-final. Melon Soda was just running away with it until yeah. until, until he wasn't. He was in the lead the whole time until that miss drop at the end. Uh, oh, wait, he, he couldn't. It's not a miss drop. He just couldn't bring the piece to the yeah. left anymore. Well, yeah. Well, no, he yeah. could actually. He could. He got the line piece over. He burned it a, a bit down. The square was easier than the line piece to get over there, but he didn't get the square over. Oh, uh, well. Uh, well, de depends yep. on how you want to see it, yep. I guess. Yes, but yes. he could have gotten the square over. Yes. I mean, if you can get the line over, you can get the square over. Yep. All the more. All right. So we are waiting for ready for both Dimsy and Melon for the next game. Oh, these games are way too exciting. Indeed. It's like it's like he got the line over. It's like, can he get the line over? He does. Can he, he'll get the square over. No, he doesn't. Lost grip? What is yeah. that? No, he lost, he dropped the grip on his on his on oh. his controller. Uh, yeah. is, is, is that a tapper thing? I mean, that's a tapper <laughs> thing. It kind of is, right? Oh, I mean I even dancers, right? If you get your hands sweaty and then it just slips out of your hand. I mean I think it happened before back in 2019 to me. Alright, we have a ready for both player. Three, two, one. Tetris and game two is underway okay let me make this into a single view so like that yes perfect so let's do this it's really anybody's game at this point it's like if, if this day has if this day has taught us anything it's like don't expect it you can't you can't really expect anything nobody's safe yeah it's like then it's like it's like melon soda was safe until he wasn't yeah oh dimsy with the aggressive build up here i mean think they had a track record to survive right so even yes. though he was behind this was still a you know, whoever tops out can be caught up easily. Oh yeah, of course. Just mm -hmm. uh, this why in general, topping out early, regardless of how far ahead you are, is always a killer. Yeah, no lead is safe. All right, so Melon with an early lead, one point five plus Tetrises. Takes a safety double. So, early score update: ninety-five thousand points for Melon. Uh, 78,000 points for Dimsy. Although, really, this score update is really more for Dimsy than Melon. I don't think Melon is capable of uh, really hearing us on yeah. on his side. I think from Melon's perspective, he just does the absolute best he can and see how far he goes. Basically, right? And look how far he's going, right? Yeah. <laughs> Makes you almost wonder if he could actually hear us, would he actually try to play safer there? Oh, yeah, he did have a safe lead earlier, but he, yes. he didn't know. He, he wouldn't have Ooh. known. 
A little bit of mist dropped from Melon, but he can clean this up easy. Hopefully. Yeah, but will he clean this fast though? That's the that's the perhaps the more important point. Oh he yeah. could have could he? Burned no, double. he couldn't have, no. DMC is not scoring. Okay, he does score the Tetris. So actually the little burn that uh, Melon has to do, the dig. Oh it mist drop. Brought, it brought the lead to DMZ. Fortunate mist drop there by Melon. Needs to start bringing up the needs to start picking up the pace a bit here. Otherwise he's gonna be stuck here in this rut for a long, long time. Alright, Dimsy is also doing a bit of burning, but he's in a much better state. He's Tetris ready. Melon is still digging. He's just not managing to open up his well. Okay, he's got, is he gonna try for a dirty Tetris? Oh, Melon. No, 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 he's not, he's not. Yes, it's too early. It's too early to go for that kind of aggression. Mm. Oh! Oh, oh, no, oh. He, mis he miscalculated. Yeah. He miscalculated what would burn. He takes a triple. This is really allowing Dimsy to take a lead. He's now two and a half Tetris Ooh. ahead, 58,000 points. So we have 227k versus 169k. That's a lot of weight. I think Melon is starting to starting to crack under pressure here. Okay, no, he's cleaning it up. He's cleaning it up. It's just taking a long time. His Tetris rate. Look at this. Look at this Tetris rate graph. He's been burning for so long. His Tetris rate is just going downhill. Yeah. A very gentle downhill, but downhill all the same. I mean, Dimsy is not having a fantastic Tetris raid, but his board is clean and he's really benefiting from all this digging Melon is doing. I mean, 10% Tetris raid is, uh, is, is actually quite significant if, it, if, yes. if, if it's maintained. And right now it's 20% Tetris raid difference. Ooh, what happened to Dimsy? Okay, he's taking the, taking the burn, it's fine. Melon is almost clean finally, sort of. Oh, Melon could be in a little bit of trouble here. Burns another double. But he's Melon, a long bar. Melon just, just can't get out of this dig. J, a J piece or a long bar. He needs it right now. Oh, he's going to drive for dirty Tetris. Wow, and that he is disgusting. <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> that, this is, this is a, this is a, this is a qualifier, damn it. Mm -hmm. This is the CTWC. Oh, oh no, no. He's a miss drop. Okay, this is going to be tough. This is trouble. He needs, he needs, he a, needs a right piece. He needs a long bar J right now. J piece is good. Oh, not good enough. Will he, he be able? He brings it over. No, oh. he cannot bring it over. He's hanging the L piece and he tops out. And DMC takes a win at 308k with four Tetris ahead of lead. Wow. Oh, that was that. <laughs> you can see from the, the Tetris red graph that yes. disgusting Tetris that just happened earlier. But what the a initial, dig. Like... What a dig. All right. I don't know if the players are, 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 are tired as we are. Oh, yes, sorry. So we need to give a hop to Dimsy. Uh, sorry, where's my mouse? Mouse, where are you? There you go. Second hop for Dimsy. Dimsy is one game away from going mm -hmm. to the final. All right, Melon is doing a little bit of practice right now. I can tell that his producer is not focused. Yeah. Uh, Melon, uh, okay, I think we're gonna need to ping Melon if uh, if he doesn't fix this right now. So we have a third place match, people are asking. Well, we'll have to see if uh, if time permits, but at the rate that this is going, it doesn't seem very uh, yeah, promising. Yeah, I, I, I think not, sadly. Well, well, and we only have a prize for the for the first place first anyways. Place. Yes. Yeah, so what we're really interested in getting is the top winner. And if we had if we had a bit more time, we could, but we thought we would be done by 6 p.m. It's already 6.30ish, yes. and we haven't even started the final. So I think we'd be done around 7 o'clock, maybe. At this rate, yes. yes. And we've been, we've been running for almost six hours at this point already. Yes. All right, so we have a ready for both player and let's go for game three. Three, two, one, Tetris. <laughs> All right, so. I, I have a newfound respect from uh, for Chris Tang and James Chen. Like, this whole commentating gig is, is damn tiring. It is tiring, it is tiring. I know, I've done, I, I've done this as well as like with, uh, with CTP as well and boy. Uh, like we'll start at like midnight, I believe. We'll start midnight local time here, and then we'll be done by six a.m. Oh man! Oh, I tell you, it's tiring. It, I'm like, I'm like, hats off to the guys on the main channel of on, on CTP. It's like guys, guys are doing the the hard work because 
the alternate channels tend to go down faster. All right, Melon on a on a dirty. He's opening. Tetris ready. Dirty Tetris right off the bat at roll six or seven. That was disgusting, but amazing. <laughs> Takes another Tetris. Boom, Tetris for Melon. Pace off. So Torza had just an early lead, but that's only because uh, Melon had, was in a draw and was so high initially. But so now Melon has a lead with 4,000 points. 76,000 points versus 71,000 points right now. <laughs> Both players having very clean boards. No problem. Ooh, okay, that was weird. Okay, okay. So Tetris ready for Melon Solo. Oh, beautiful spin by Torza. Torza? By Dimzy. Sorry, what am I talking about? Dimzy. Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> I know, Dimsy and Torza look look really, really similar. <laughs> they're, they're the Z they sound look, in their name, so I get confused. They look like uh, <laughs> they could almost be brothers. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's see here. Melon Soda with the nice clean board here. Not quite Tetris ready. But now yeah, it's Tetris so... ready. Ooh, we get a late flash of a yeah, Tetris. I, I think the... Um... The, the the board piece count has a little bit is a little bit messed up, so the, the Tetris flashes will be off. But the yeah. score should be correct. So, the score will always be correct yes. as far as we are aware. So Melon is ahead by just a little bit less than one Tetris, because uh, the score is basically uh, independently verified by the yes by the OBS. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Why, why, was that was that a wise move to do? <laughs> that didn't look wise at all. Okay, it okay. looks like he'll get out of this. Just okay, fine. takes a, a triple. <sighs> that was close. Yes. So Dimzy is ahead, but both players are neck and neck right now. Less than 1,000 point difference between the two. Dimzy takes one Tetris, doing a nice stock. Melon is Tetris ready, takes the Tetris. Another Tetris. So and both players are back down and they are clean. Wow. So That's we're really neck and neck here. It's like there's only a 0 0.13 Tetris difference in terms of pace here. So it's yeah. like basically neck and neck here. It's like everything's going to come down to who's going to get like just a little bit more point as far as as far as um, things are going right now yeah so they are just past the halfway point for level nine, uh, 18 sorry at 60 plus line 65 plus line for 31 drought 32 drought 35 yeah, melon is on a nasty drop right now oh this is nasty dimzy immediately takes the lead oh. but dimzy doesn't have a clean board either 42 piece drought i believe that's the highest yeah. highest all day but Dimzy was digging, so he could not benefit from that that uh, drop that uh, Melon was experiencing. So his lead was is stuck at uh, two Tetrises. Both players are Tetris ready right now. Boom Tetris for Melon. Forty six thousand points uh, difference between both uh, between both players. Yes, we more have. than halfway through to uh, the nineteen transition. Yeah. We have 368,000 for Dimzy versus 324,000 for Melon. Dimzy is on 70% Tetris rate. He's still on a 1.3 mil pace right now. 1.3 mil pace. Jeez Louise. Yes. Oh, beautiful T-spin. Oh, I love saying it. T-spin. Yeah. It's like the most high risk. High risk. High reward, you could say. It just looks play cool. outside of maybe the line spin. Wait, no. Which which would be more which would be more risky, the line spin or the T spin? If you miss a line spin, actually, if you miss a line, no, no, it, can, it can it can be devastating. If you miss a line spin, spin, you could have a double line dependency as a result. Of exactly, it. <laughs> exactly. And if a T spin, the worst is you get maybe one hole actually. Yes. All right. So Dimzy is maintaining his two point something Tetris lead. The score is now 442k for Dimzy to 378k for Melon. So really neck and neck at this point, to be honest, this, given how late we are into the game, the 1-2 difference is not much, not yet anyways. If But if this 1-2 difference does lead on into the late stages of 19, it, oh, those 1-2 difference, uh, Tetris differences are going to be massive because of how little runway you have left by that point. Yep. Both players are clean right now. Dimzy is Tetris ready. Melon is not yet. He has to build up for Tetris right now. So we're almost going to transition here. Transition for Melon. Dimzy is going to transition any second now. Melon's going to transition at 472,000 points. Dimzy 
It's about to transition at 540,000. 540,000, yes. Both players are now on level 19. Dimzi is still maintaining his 1 point something lead. It's not 2 point something anymore though. And Dimzi is not yet Tetris ready. He's Tetris ready now, takes the Tetris, bring back his lead to 2.6. Melon is waiting for good pieces, gets the Tetris. Ooh. Dimzi. Baller. This okay. is getting this is getting really tight here. Both players are just playing phenomenally well. I think I think that one-two Tetris difference at the rate that this is going is really going to be the difference maker yep. for who's going to win this match. It's still early. They still have uh, ninety, no, eight, sorry, eighty, seventy line to go. Yes, they yes. go all the way to kill screen. So I think still anything can happen, but they anything are both can happen, playing yes. fantastically right now. Exactly. So it's like if they're just neck and neck with each other and just going the distance, it's yeah. like really that one-two difference is all that's going to matter at this point. Ooh. Dimsey decides. Uh, Dimsey had a bit of cold feet there. Might be for the best, actually. Okay, Melon is okay. He really needs a line. Oh! Oh, he gets the line. Drop. Okay, he gets okay, the line. Perfect, perfect. He's still safe. He's still safe. A line piece would be great, but he doesn't really need it. Yeah. Meanwhile, the 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 lead has dropped a little bit. Okay, not anymore. Sorry. Uh, Dimsey is at two and a half Tetris lead right now. Oh, Melon soda. Melon is all the way to the bottom. Clean, clean as a whistle. He's gonna start building up from here. Oh, this is this is tight. This is really tight. One hundred thousand difference at this point. So yes, seven twenty three versus six one nine. Oh, Dimsy, uh, Dimsy, Dimsy is gonna take this at the rate that this is going. Melon Soda needs to do ham, absolute ham, and even then, it's it's still it's still dependent on on Dimsy just doing a poor performance throughout the rest of this uh, which, run, which, which is not happening at all. Dimsy is killing it right now. Yeah, he's absolutely destroying this game. Ooh, boy. Oh boy, and Melon Soda is going to a small a small rut here. He cannot afford this small rut. Both player though, Dimsy is not having great pieces right now. Okay, but he managed to burn it down. Oh, oh, Melon Soda is a little bit. Ooh, nice tapping, fast taps. Okay, this is really tough. Dimsy is clean. Melon is struggling. Uh, I don't. Oh, I think that, a line I think, that burns nothing that hurts. I think. I think this. I think this is going to be it for Melon. There's only 20 more lines left to go. Yep. Ten thousand points. He gets ten thousand points per uh, per per um, Tetris here. Dimsy but... is still on max out pace, while Melon definitely is not. I think that's yeah. The runway. He only has eight hundred and fifty nine thousand. He can only get eight hundred and fifty nine thousand points if he Tetrises everything from here on out. Yes. He cannot. It's not that okay, he cannot. It. Not without we, we already know that he cannot yes. make it. Not without playing some twenty nine plays. Oh yes. Can he do twenty nine plays? He needs twenty nine plays, or he's not going to win this. Yeah, he, his runway to kill screen is less than the score of Dimzy right now. Without some twenty nine stellar plays, oh, but it doesn't look like he's going to be twenty nine. He can't. No, he no, can't survive no. twenty nine even even if he makes it. GGs. Absolutely. And kill GGs. screen, and he cannot. Fantastic game. Well played. Wow. Okay, is Dimzy gonna try to go for max out? No, he stopped right before max out. Hey. Oh no, he, he wanted to. <laughs> he wanted to. Oh, <laughs> we don't get our first max out here at CTSC. Yep. <laughs> wow. Absolutely, what a absolute game. GGs. Absolute GGs. So let's give this heart to, D to Dimzy, and this is a complete sweep 3 0. Let's give him his winner screen right there. Oh, yeah, sorry. I give, I give you control, Paul. Yes, <laughs> let me just take a. Quick, let me just do a quick update over yeah, over ahead, the guys. over the brackets, and then we will have a quickly. We can quickly move on into the finals, which, we, which is going to be Joel versus Dimsy. And here you have our finalists. All right, here you have your finalists, Joel versus Dimsy. Uh, We've been in six hours in the running. I believe everybody's tired, and all, that's all the more why this matchup is going to be so absolutely exciting. We want to see who is going to run, who who's going to make the distance here. So let's uh, let's start bringing in our players. Wait, let's see.